Hey guys, Minaminas here. Today I want to do something a little bit different. You probably expected another video talking about this movie again, right? Nope. I wanted to do something super different. Today, I'm talking about The Good Dinosaur. Ah, oh, yes. The Good Dinosaur. The Pixar movie people love to hate. Despite having a positive score on Rotten Tomatoes and mixed to positive reviews, the internet has not been kind to this movie. Seriously. Look up this movie on YouTube and brace yourself. And it doesn't help that this movie was Pixar's first ever box office bomb. I'm 100% convinced people hate The Good Dinosaur more than Cars 2. Which is weird considering that Cars 2 to this day is the only Pixar movie with a rotten score on Rotten Tomatoes. Also, just because a movie bombs doesn't always mean it's bad. Treasure Planet bombed at the box office and people love it to death. Note, I'm not trying to force opinions. If you don't like or hate The Good Dinosaur, that's fine. It's not one of Pixar's best and it does have some flaws. But in my opinion, saying it's a bad movie is a bit too harsh. It's still a good, fun and heartwarming movie that isn't worthy of having so much hate. However, there's one thing that the internet does with this movie and it really pisses me off. And that is when people compare it to The Lion King and say they're basically the same movie. Don't get me wrong though. I love The Lion King. It's one of Disney's greatest movies. The animation, the music, the visuals, it's beautiful. And I can see where they're coming from. Such as both movies have pointy rock structures that represent home. Both Simba and Arlo lose their father at a young age. And both protagonists end up miles away from home. But I feel like people like Cinemasons and The Brooks Show were wearing rose-colored glasses when comparing both The Good Dinosaur and The Lion King because if you actually pay attention to the movies then you can see that despite having similarities, they're not the same at all. So without further ado, here are my reasons why The Good Dinosaur and The Lion King are not the same movie. Okay, first off, Simba was born into royalty with his father Mufasa and mother Sarabi and had this really epic ceremony. Arlo was just a farm boy. He's no prince. He was born in a farm with his father Henry and mother Ida. He was the last to hatch among his siblings Libby and Buck. Also, speaking of which, unlike Simba, Arlo has siblings. No, Nala doesn't count. They're just friends. Also that would be weird considering they fall in love later in the movie. The characters of Simba and Arlo are also completely different. Simba is adventurous and brave, not afraid to go into dangerous territory. He even said it well himself. He laughs at the face of danger. Arlo is literally the opposite of Simba. He's afraid of everything. For Pete's sake he can't even feed a chicken without running away screaming. And while both movies have a scene where father and son interact, what makes The Lion King different is that this would be the last time Mufasa and Simba hang out together before his death as after Arlo and Henry spend time together the next scene is with the two building a trap to catch the critter stealing their core. Speaking of their deaths, the way they die is completely different. Henry's death was an accident. Mufasa's death was straight up murder. Long live the king. After the death of his father, despite the one actually responsible, Scar blames Simba for the death of his father telling him it's all his fault. With Arlo however, Henry's death was his fault. If he had killed the critter as he was told, he would still be alive. However, he instead blames the critter spot and chases him angrily, leading to him falling in the river and getting swept miles away from home. Another difference is how the protagonist ends up miles away from home. Arlo fell into a river. Simba ran away. When Arlo wins up miles away from home, his first instinct is to get back remembering his father's words. As long as you can find the river, you can find your way home. Simba, believing he's responsible for Mufasa's death, decides not to go back and stays with Taimon and Pumba. It's not until he's visited by the ghost of his dead father that he decides to go back. Also, I'm going to debunk Cinemasons when he said the protagonist was offered bugs as food as Simba while hesitant gave it a try and ended up liking it in the end. Arlo wouldn't give the beetle a try, especially when Spot ripped its head off.
Also, in the Brooks Show's video comparing the two, one of the points he makes is that in both movies a father figure teaches the protagonist a life lesson, but the clip he used is when Mufasa and Simba were having a heart-to-heart -heart before his death. Before his journey, what's the point if you show a clip that's before Mufasa's death? I get the similarity but for Simba it's Mufasa teaching Simba about the great kings of the past and for Arlo it's Butch teaching him to get through fear. Another similarity people point out is that both Simba and Arlo see a vision of their dead father and interact with them. I do see their point but you do realize Arlo was knocked out so he was basically hallucinating. When Simba encounters his father, was he knocked out or hallucinating? No, Mufasa was just a random magic voodoo ghost. When Arlo finally returns home, he has no more obstacles to overcome. He overcame his fears, stopped Thunderclap and took care of Spot the best way possible. After returning home, Simba has one more obstacle he has to overcome. His uncle Scar before finally getting his happy ending. Two bonus differences. The Lion King is a musical. The good dinosaur is not. Did Arlo and Spot break into song once? No. Another difference is that unlike the Lion King, Arlo is currently single. Note. I'm talking about the original movie. Not the Mega Minus crossover universe where he's dating my avatar. Just to clear things up in case you're confused. And those are my reasons why the good dinosaur and the Lion King have little in common. If you agree with me that's cool. But if you think this is a bunch of baloney and I'm stupid I won't hold that against you. You're allowed to have an opinion. Hope you like my video. Peace out my homies.